Hey guys, I'm back again and this video is going to be about volume. Big hair, don't care. We all love volume. Some of us don't. Some of us are naturally born with amazing thick hair. Unfortunately, my hair is not that thick. So I really like to have volume. So this is my best friend and it's a comb. So what I'm going to do first is my hair is just a little bit wet just because I wasn't completely finished diffusing my hair. So I'm going to take the diffuser and I'm going to take this part off. I'm a professional at diffusing my hair now. So, you know, once you're comfortable diffusing your hair and if you want volume, you can create, you can do all my tricks. But this is one of them. I'm going to put it on low and I'm going to grab my hair just like a diffuser hand and I'm going to blow dry inside of it. I'm going to flip my hair over and do that and then you'll see how much bigger my hair will be after that. Okay guys, so now I'm going to take my fingers and just kind of slide on my scalp like this and shake. Don't shake too much because you can create frizz. So I go on my scalp and then I take my hands out and I go in the middle here, shake it up a little bit, take my hands out, go right here, shake it up a little bit, take my hands out. And now I will take the comb. This is my favorite trick. And you're not brushing your hair, you're not combing your hair. You're just putting it inside and then removing it out. Putting it inside, removing it. Putting it inside, removing it. As you guys can see, I have a little bit more volume than when I started this video. So don't overdo it, um, I just do a little bit and this can create frizz. So if you want volume and you have thin hair, you can create a little bit of frizz. And I do create a little bit of frizz and I'm okay with that. I love my frizz, it does give me some more volume and that's it. And we are going to be creating a volume serum that's going to work amazing with our gel. And this is it. So a lot of people are like, you know, I could never do that trick with the brush because I would, you know, cause a lot of frizz. If you just stick it in and take it out, stick it in, take it out, stick it in, take it out, you're kind of disturbing the curl bed just a little bit, which can create a little bit of frizz. But if you do it correctly, and you know, everything takes time and practice, so if you do it correctly, I think you guys will be great. All right. All right, guys, I'll see you in the next video.